Welcome back everybody to Sunrise POS, sunrisepos.com. Today I was going to just do a quick tutorial for you on setting up your menu items to print to a particular kitchen printer. Um, a lot of our customers use um, uh, remote kitchen printers. Some have hot prep areas, cold prep areas, uh, wraps, uh, things like that. Um, you can have up to six kitchen printers or uh, KDSs if you're using monitors on the Aldello for Restaurant system, so that's really good. So in here, if you uh, click uh, here on back office, uh, one thing you're going to want to go into is your station settings. And under printers here, you want to make sure that you have your receipt printer chosen to your, uh, your obviously, your correct uh, uh, printer. And then if you do have a kitchen printer, um, you do have multiple kitchen printers here in the system. Um, so we could set up, say, our uh, QPDF printer is one of them. Uh, and let's say this is our wraps. Uh, printer and that goes to uh, say this office jet printer here which obviously I'm doing this on a PC so um, and then if you have maybe you've got uh, cold prep and you go through and hit your drop down type on that and we'll choose the uh, Canon uh, printer for that um, also on these um, I like to choose the Epson um, uh, TM U200 large font auto cut um, that's a great, uh, going to give you a nice big uh, print on that, and it will also um, auto cut for you as well. Uh, so we'll go through and choose the Epson large font auto cut uh, for all of these. As you can see, it supports uh, multiple um, multiple kitchen printers. I um, just want to tell it which uh, printer you're using, and our Sunrise POS is the Epson uh, emulation, so you'd uh, choose that printer there. So I'm going to click on Save and Done. Now that I have three printers set up in the in the in the uh, uh, system, when I go into my menu item itself, I can go through and uh, let's say it's uh, this particular um, side, uh, this uh, baked potato. I want this to kit print to my hot prep, uh, which would be my uh, kitchen. Uh, printer here. So I'm going to click on save and done and now every time I ring in this baked potato it's going to print to that ki particular kitchen printer. Where now if I go into like my soups and salads and I choose this garden salad here I want that to print to my cold prep area. So I'll go ahead and choose this uh, cold prep printer here for my cold prep items. Uh, so all my garden salad uh, here every time I ring in no matter how many stations I've got it's all going to print to this particular cold prep printer. So I'll save and done on that. And that is how you set up uh, in your, you know, your multiple uh, kitchen printers and how you set the every your individual items to print to that particular kitchen printer. So you do need to set uh, those uh, station printers up on each station uh, so they do recognize wh which pr the, the, the printer is now attached to uh, that POS unit and that will definitely help with um, making that a real smooth transition and getting all your orders routed correctly. Alright, thank you very much. Uh, please feel free to visit us on sunrisepos.com or give us a call if you have any additional questions. Thank you.